Hi guys, in today's video I'm going to show you how to set up your portable dryer, which I'm pointing at currently. I'm in my bedroom, that's where uh, my dryer is, and I had it for like almost two years, something like that. Actually, should I should definitely record uh, like a two-year review, because under my one-year review, Ali left a comment. <sighs> Sorry, my phone is dirty. I don't know if you can see that. Uh, but Ali said, I wanted to see the setup and the connection too. Uh, so I'm not sure if I showed you guys in the three month review, the first video, uh, which I did on this uh, dryer. And the setup is actually super easy. So this video will be hopefully like under 10 minutes because um, after unboxing <laughs> this uh, dryer, which is also surprisingly not as happy, not as happy, not as heavy, it's pretty happy, uh, not as heavy as I thought. This is one of the biggest portable dryers and I was able to set it up myself um, and yeah, here it is, it's super easy. So let's get into it. So I'm gonna disconnect my uh, portable dryer to show you how I uh, set it up and I usually store my pillows on it because I have a very small bedroom so this is actually a cool storage space. Of course I take it off uh, before starting the uh, the dryer next to the window uh, so yeah uh, I would definitely recommend you guys put it somewhere around the window so you can vent it out of the window I know that some people um, sorry maybe that's gonna be better <laughs> uh, I know that some people don't vent out of the window I actually got a comment recently someone was saying that this is basically like a blow dryer like a blow dryer heater uh, so in the winter time they don't vent the uh, dryer out of the window they just let it let the air um, vent in their room it is slightly humid someone told me in the comments I wanted to share so this is where I store my portable dryer like you can see in the corner in my bedroom super tiny bedroom um, but it's next to the window so it's a perfect spot for it because I can uh, vent it out of the window uh, and there is also an outlet here so it's literally a perfect spot and when I'm working here this is my desk when I'm working here um, and I'm also running a dryer I just use the curtains to um, keep it quieter it's usually closer to the wall but since I'm trying to show you guys how to set it up I move the dryer but uh, that's what I do I just put the uh, curtain all over the dryer and it gets a lot quieter so it's not a trick uh, but yeah um, so you get the dryer with an outlet I additionally put this smart plug so I can like, I can check uh, how much electricity the dryer takes and then uh, I actually record a separate video that I'm gonna link down below how much this dryer um, takes and you also get this vent and this is already mounted at least it was mounted when I got it uh, this part was separate this part this is a hose it was uh, it's a plastic hose super light hose you can actually if you if you lose it uh, you can get it at a hardware store or Home Depot um, and this was attached to it this metal um, part <laughs> uh, so I just put it on the top and um, you plug it all here and then you tighten this screw up so um, make sure that it's sitting here because if you're not gonna use the screw it may just fall uh, it happened a few times uh, it's not a big deal honestly uh, and this vent as you can see goes all around and oh my god it's so bright okay much better <laughs> so I just keep this uh, vent here and it's a little beat up because sometimes I forget <laughs> that I have this hose here and I close the window on it so yeah it's a little beat up but keep this hose right here it's not as you can see perfectly facing the window but it works um, and that that works for me so <laughs> this is pretty much it and then of course I have to connect this to the ooh, to the wall right here and I move this and it's connected right here and uh, this is pretty flexible so you can stretch it a little more if you need to uh, but yeah and then So yeah, 
This is it. This is how you set up your portable dryer. It's super easy, like I said. Uh, doesn't require, you know, a handyman. You can do it yourself, like I did. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let me know if you have any questions uh, down below. And if you like this video, don't forget to subscribe and leave a like. And I'll see you soon in the next video. Bye-bye.